Hey gang, welcome to Scuba Diver Magazine. Yesterday, Fourth Element announced their new Storm Jacket. And as the name suggests, it's kind of based on their Storm Poncho, uh, but they've basically turned the material into a more traditional jacket style cut. So ponchos have risen in popularity in the scuba diving circles uh, in recent years because between dives, you can just throw it over yourself and protect yourself from the elements. You can get changed underneath it. It's very practical, so it makes sense, but ponchos aren't for everybody. And the Storm in particular, it doesn't have a zipper down the front or down the sides or anywhere. So you kind of have to climb into it like a sock. So some divers steered away. They made the Tidal, uh, which does have a zipper, but Fourth Element has tailored the same thin material from the Storm into a hooded jacket in both a men's and a women's cut. And they're selling it as a kind of a cool day jacket to throw over yourself or a colder day mid layer so that you put something over the top of it as well. Um, it has that very thin fleecy interior that's made from recycled bottles and coffee grounds of all things. So it's environmentally friendly, um, but those coffee grounds, they actually help to improve the drying time. It dries much faster, helps with odor resistance and also UV reflection. So it's protecting you from the sun as well as the water. Uh, as far as water resistance, it's got a 10,000 millimeter hydrostatic head or something, uh, which is seen as a good rating for most waterproof jackets in the hiking community and it has a simple just smart design to it so you're not going to stand out either on the dive site or whenever you wherever you go after your dive um, right now it only seems to be available in black but we might see it in the red and the blue like the storm poncho if this design turns out to be popular later on and this isn't the first time that we've seen this from fourth element they turned their arctic and zero therm undersuits into hoodies so it's not unusual and it kind of makes sense if you produce a load of this material why not turn it into a few different designs um so now that things are starting to cool down uh, in the winter, in the Northern Hemisphere at least, it may be worth checking some of these out. Um, I can certainly attest to the warmth of the Arctic material, having worn it in the Arctic Circle. And you can find out more about the new Storm Jacket either by clicking on this link to one of our affiliate dive stores in your area or by visiting fourthelement.com. Please subscribe to the Scuba Diving Magazine channel for the latest scuba diving news and other scuba diving content. Thank you for watching everybody and of course, safe diving.